Jeete Hai Chal is uh, the first song that was uh, out and there are four songs in the film. Uh, four, right? Four yeah. songs. Uh, there's Jeete Hai Chal, there's, uh, um, there's Aake Milangi Darse which is right now my, uh, my personal <coughs> favourite. Um, then there's the mother song. Uh, what is it called, the mother song? Aisa Kyuma. Aisa Kyuma. And then there's a love song which we'll be launching very soon. Um, so there are four songs and they're all um, situational, they're all inspirational and uh, there is obviously no lip sync in this film but uh, it adds to the performance. Uh, see, uh, filmmaking is a collaboration, it's a collaborative process and I don't think anything separately works and music is such an integral part of it. And um, especially in a film like Nija, the music is has to be really like delicate and beautiful and add to the film. And I think uh, Vishal has done an amazing job with that. So, um, and they are all written so beautifully, so beautifully. And that's all Prasoon sir. I mean, he's the person who wrote uh, Masakali for me. Like I said inside, it made me world famous in India. I'm using Atul's lines and uh, it made me Sonam Kapoor. And it was, a story, it was a song about freedom and I think over here, he knows how to write for young people, I feel. He, know, he understands the voice of young people. So where Masakali was about freedom of a young person in India, for me, um, uh, Aake Milayenge Darse is the voice of what I think the youth in India are feeling right now. That we don't want to be scared anymore, we want to face everybody and everything and have an opinion like we do on everything. So. I think he gets the pulse and uh, he is, I think, one of the most important poets of our time right now. So I'm very, very excited that Prasun sir has done three of my films. Yay! Uh, the music for this film is very simple and very heartfelt. And I think uh, it's because of the inspiring lyrics of Prasun sir that, um, you know, it adds that real emotion or whatever. And the film is very genuine and very raw and very honest. and. The performance of Sonam especially is like mind blowing. Okay, so you're not supposed to say that. I know, but <laughs> that uh, was the real inspiration. I keep saying that this film is about the youth for the youth. She was 23 years old, and if you see the energy in that song, it's 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 the pulse of what we're feeling, you know, and um, that drum in our heart to kind of work, 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 do something, do something, do something. So I think it's like uh, it's it's uh, Ram's. Uh, he's using his advertising and he's using it for our film to say that this is the essence of the song we can't tell you what the story is about but this is what we're trying to say with the film uh, I actually honestly uh, but I was a very shy person <laughs> I was very shy uh, I'm not very good at public speaking I had a stage fright actually 8 years before I had a stage performance and after that I had never performed on stage till I did Stardust or something, uh, I did a star in Stardust I danced again after 8 years and that's only because I did Nija and I realized that it's a small thing, it's going up on stage and facing people and performing or dancing or talking on stage, I don't know if you've never heard me host a show or danced on stage or any of those things and only because I did Nija I realized yaar main kaun hu yaar maine kya kiya life mein is this girl faced fear and she saved life and she realized she was fearful for her life and she still did it what am I fearful for ki log kya kahenge and I think that's everybody's biggest fear ab ab maine ek uh, uh, campaign kiya hai fear versus Nija or I'm telling you 90% of the people who have been tagging me and tagging fear versus Nija are all afraid to be themselves and are afraid of log kya kahenge and I think that's all our fear right now and so that was my biggest fear. Look.